this week I'm going to be talking about the cost of maintenance for landlords. My advice to landlords is to always make sure that you have a slush fund for your maintenance requirements. Landlords don't often consider this and what they think about is the rent just coming in and not making any payments out of it. But what you need to ensure is that you keep a pot of money so that you have it there for when you have any maintenance requirements because you never know whether your property is new or old it could be at any point in time that you could have a boiler breakdown or you could have something go wrong with the hot water um, or you could have a leak in the property and you should always ensure that you have a pot of money to cover this we've had instances in the past where for example the boiler was broke down the landlord hasn't factored this in to their money and then they have kind of a thousand pound bill possibly to change the whole entire boiler so i will always recommend that you ensure that you keep just a small pot of money on the side so if you do have any maintenance in the future that it doesn't hit you as hard especially if it's a larger bill and that's all for this week mm -hmm.